Hello and welcome to the show. It has been some time since a day who has gone up against the army, but fear not, because we have another one. This is, I'm going to have to read it off the badge because I'm not going to be able to pronounce it very well. The uh, P Polon Poloners? I don't know. Uh, that, that's as close as I'm going to get. I, I apologize. Um, however, yes, we have another day to try and escape the army. This, I have to say, is about the most detailed car mod I've ever seen for GTA 5. There are quite literally hundreds of different configurations for the vehicle, from police cars to rally cars to uh, beat up, uh, completely wrecked uh, vehicles. I've gone for the kind of a state car body with some rally bits on the front. It looked quite good to me. Uh, it looked quite silly to me is perhaps the better way of putting it. Yes, we've got a Dayu Racing Estate with a move over sticker on the front. And it's going to try and get away from the army. Now, you might think that that is a little bit on the crazy side. However, if you are relatively new to this series, Deus have a rather impressive track record as far as escaping the army goes. They have got away in far quicker times and far easier than a lot of normal vehicles. There are chases where they should never have managed to get away from the army. But they have. So, I'm kind of hoping for that once more. Oh, we've found a bush immediately. Well, that's a good start. We haven't all broken completely, so I guess, you know, that that's, uh, <laughs> that's helpful. It's a sturdy car. Uh, right, all of the army have completely and utterly driven past. If you can do the same trick that you did with the quad ski and just ignore the Dayu, uh, I'd be okay with that. It might not make for the most exciting of videos, but maybe if you could crash into each other and ignore the Dayu. That is, the, that is what we want to be going on, really. The army making a fool of themselves and the Dayu able to get away. That is what everyone is hoping for. Slightly losing the rear bumper. And the uh, <laughs> the tape on the headlights didn't... But actually, no, the tape on the headlights has lasted. Uh, I think it's just, yeah, the bumper's been pushed back, so the tape is now inside the headlights. I'm not sure that's quite how how, how headlight tape is supposed to work. Oh, um, that's a big cute. <laughs> so there is an ambulance variant that apparently, have, or police car variant and so on. I think that might be from the ambulance one because the, the height it is at. I guess when I was flicking through the parts, it still kind of had a, a, a phantom bit left on. So don't worry about the light at the top there. Ignore that. Uh, we've got a roadblock to get through. Yes, stand in the way of the mighty day. You shall come with me, army chap. Um, yeah, you don't, you don't stand in the way of a mighty day. You. It's never going to end well for you until we have got 60 miles an hour. 60, oh no, we might break 70. We might just about break the speed limit in a police chase. Come on, Deu, you can do it. You can do it. We're gonna have to swerve because there's an army vehicle in front of us. Go! Ah! We, oh, we've got we've got a new party trick. We've got a bunny hopping Deu. We've been slightly undressed by the barracks as well. It's a little bit unfortunate. We're shedding weight, that's what it is. We're going for weight reduction here. That rear, rear left is not looking healthy. <laughs> God, how did the wanted radius? How did, the, how did that work? How the bloody hell did that work? Now, I could. There is a tiny possible, possible way that I could actually make this work as a getaway here. If this, if this could happen, this would be the greatest getaway of all time. It's not going to because I can see a helicopter coming this way way too quickly. If we can chuck it up this hill. No, they saw us. Oh. Damn it, the day you almost living up to its truly legendary uh, ancestors in this series so far. We've done it again! We're out of the wanted radius! Hide in the trees! The tree... Ah, oh, okay, we're not quite well enough hidden. That that police helicopter... You see, if I, I'd feared if I'd gone forward. Army vehicles, army jeeps spawn on this road and they'd just see me anyway. Oh! Hello! Hello, Messer. That was not a fun... Not a particularly fun meeting. If we could leave the day you alone, that'd be really helpful. Oh... Oh, it so nearly worked. We so nearly had an amazing first escape. Uh, <laughs> would have literally been perfect. I don't think I could have asked more from the car, in all honesty. Uh, right, we're going to have to continue. Oh, dear. Ugh. We've been scooped. Ooh. Um, I've also seen a small issue. I've seen a, a quite, a, quite a, a soggy issue as well. The engine is smoking. We're leaking fuel. Damn it. It might not be the strongest of, of cars, this one. I know that's a strange thing to say about a Dayu. Uh, however, it may not be the strongest getaway vehicle I've ever tried to use. It almost did it, though. Most impressively is it very, very nearly 
did get away from the army. I don't know how much longer we have before this will give up the uh, give up the ghost with the amount of fuel that's coming out of it. I guess we're not going to set fire to our own fuel trail, which is kind of helpful, but it will eventually drain the... I say eventually, it probably won't take long for it to drain the tank, and then we will be done for. Can we do... And that problem is we might be able to kind of dive off into the... Uh, race course or somewhere over this way, but the helicopters are just too close. The helicopters are way, way too close for any of this to actually work in terms of getting away. Now, we can keep it alive for a little bit longer uh, over here. However, I'm not going to be able to get it away, I don't think, unless the helicopters get confused, which is always a possible. There are three of them on me at this moment in time, which is far from ideal. No, go away! Leave the day you alone! You're not going to leave the day alone, are you? I don't even know where this goes, but I'm going to go wherever it is. We're going to go here, hope the helicopter crashes into some trees or into some ooh, electricity pylons and we crash into some rocks, and that's a little bit unfortunate. Never mind. Uh, ooh. That's, um... Right, we've lost, we've lost our phantom light as well. <laughs> so, I don't know if that's a plus or a negative uh, point. Right, and... Ooh, well, I guess we've got by water if we end up getting set on fire. Is there anywhere? I'm just trying to think. Is there anywhere I can sneak? Ooh. <gasps> idea. If we don't conk out before we get there, I oh, idea won't work. Oh, I've cra crashed into a wall. Idea won't work because I don't actually think there is a way. Oh, we've conked out. Oh, we've set fire to ourselves now. Um, or we've been shot at and set fire too. I'm not sure which one. Go on, water. Thank you. There you. Make it. Oh, we've sunk it anyway. I couldn't make it around the corner. No, I was, if I could have got into the storm drain, that might have worked. But you can't get into the storm drain from there. Well, we have gone down with the ship. We are, <laughs> we are done for. It is a uh, Deu submarine in here. And we have very much been beaten on our first attempt. However, however, we very nearly embarrassed the army. So, for our mighty estate's second attempt at avoiding the army, we are actually going to try a similar tactic. The the whole outrun helicopters in a straight line thing normally only works with incredibly fast supercars or sports cars. Apparently it works with the uh, Deu. I think I just completely and utterly lucked out of that. The helicopters are probably going to be the toughest thing to shake with this vehicle. We just lack speed. We lack power in our vehicle to really be able to do very much about getting away from the choppers. We have to hope that they either crash into each other or they get confused. Uh, maybe they get distracted trying to chase down a pre or something. That would work okay for me as well. But, uh, yeah, actually physically outrunning them is going to be nigh on impossible in terms of straight line. Our best bet... We've done it again! How have we done that? Oh, come on, mighty Deu. If you can do this, if you can do this... Um, we shall build a plinth and we shall we shall have a day on display. In fact, if we shall do this, one day I shall go out and buy one of these cars. I don't know, I don't even know if we can get them in England. Uh, we go to park on the side of a mountain. Um, there is no, no, I think we've got brushed aluminium day hiding on the side of a mountain. There is, it is not here. There is no possible way you could see me. Nope, definitely not. This is as far as I can climb. I'd like to go over the other side of the mountain. However, I can't. Uh, there is also some army guys now coming this way. And I'm a little bit worried they might see me. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to be seen. I'm hoping this is steep enough that they can't climb up it. Come on. Get stuck, army soldiers. Get stuck. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good at all. We're on the descent. We're going to have to kind of hope we can hide. Hope we can hide over this way. Over this way, Dave. No. Bad things have happened. Bad things have happened to the polo. We've gone, kind of tipped ourselves down the mountain a bit more. We did it! <laughs> I do not believe that. <laughs> it is just the most day you have escapes. I don't know what it is about these cars. On this game, for whatever reason, the day you is the greatest getaway car of all time. I don't think it is quite a record. But it is so very, very close. It is so close to the quad ski and the ramp jump in Sultan. This very nearly, very, very nearly has the record. I think the ramp jumping Sultan simply with his acceleration. Uh, 
will have will have got away a little bit faster because it got down the road quicker before getting out of the wanted radius. However, the day <laughs> will probably be in second or third in terms of fastest ever getaway in a car that barely does 70 miles an hour. Can it survive a train? That is the question next. Uh, for a full comprehensive test of the day, um, I mean, we've not stopped it. I would say we've survived it pretty well. Uh-oh. 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 Don't clock me into something something that I can't move, because otherwise we may end up dying here. Oh. We are also a little bit stuck. I guess this is where the day you stays. Uh, oh, we've gone for a tumble. Hey, we are down. <laughs> a little bit buckled. Still drive. Not very much. But we do still drive. Well, there we go. Living up to, uh, to tradition, the day who <laughs> has got away from the army. I guess it's time to try and take it down the dangerous road then. Well, everything is just about going according to script. When it comes to Dave's escaping the army, and yeah, that means weirdness. Weirdness has befallen so far, but can it get even crazier? Could our car really stand a chance of surviving down the dangerous road? I mean, just getting to the dangerous road is pretty damn tough. Actually, down the dangerous road? I think that might be... It might be asking too much, but then also getting away from the army in under two minutes is normally asking too much. However, the, <laughs> the car has been able to do that so far. You'll have to wait and see. The big concern is the, is the damage, really, is if we get hit a couple of times, and certainly the army are not going to be too pleased, having been embarrassed so far today. They are going to be going all guns blazing for... Oh, uh, wow. <laughs> the bush is more effective at slowing the car down. Actually, no. Tell a lie. The brakes aren't bad on this. Can't complain about the brakes, but the bush is also very effective at slowing the car. <laughs> bye bye, army cars. There's one of them upside down, and one of them fell down there and then shot all the way back up the other side. Yeah, the army are going for it. The army are going for it right now. We are going to get trained if we're not careful. Quickly, that would not be a good thing to have an argument with here whatsoever. That some rocks and a little bit of sun work a little bit of sun work from the uh, from the day right towards the dangerous road we go and best bet is going to be taking the sandy shores airfield in fact that's going to be really our only our only bet to get as far as possible we need to head that way it just minimizes the damage done to my car and the risk of running into well army vehicles uh, where are we going to be able to go safely? Oopsie daisy. Uh, not quite where I wanted to go. Come on. Get some, get some speed. Ooh, or you can... <laughs> or you can roll over in excitement at the possibility of getting in front of the day. That, that also works for me. Slightly made a wrong turning. Oh, I came off the road in a different place than I was quite expecting. So, oh, apparently picnic benches have beaten us. The army cannot... But picnic benches, oh, picnic benches have really beaten us. There we go. Oh, the army had a golden opportunity in which they have squandered. And oh, I'm still stuck, though. Unfortunately, I might have squandered my... Come on, go, 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 go. Ah, lots of people with guns have started shooting at me all at the same time. That wasn't fun. We're still alive. As is our car, amazingly. We're not leaking fuel. No, we're good. Uh <laughs> Bloody hell. Actually, it's quite... Being out in the snow... I haven't gone this way, I don't think, in the snow yet. On a GTA 5, it's all kind of uh, a little bit more difficult to see where you are, almost, with everything looking near enough the same. Uh, we are nowhere near fast enough for this to be as effective as I would like. However, having got slightly confused by a picnic area, we are now doing a little bit better. We're taking less damage. We're almost... Yes! We've cracked the speed limit! We've hit the giddy heights of 71 miles an hour. 71 miles an hour in the day as we go bouncing our way off-road here. Uh, yeah, helicopters are too fast. <laughs> helicopters, as kind of expected, really, are faster than this. So trying to like, just about stay ahead of them when we run down the uh, airfield. We can't get far enough away to actually lose sight of them. And once we start driving on, well, rough surface, we tend not to do particularly well. Um... It might actually not be a bad idea, you know, stick on the train tracks up until at least after the first of the bridges. I don't want to stay on here any longer because the train track does cross over the top of the dangerous road. And also I don't want to get caught by the train. That would not end well for me. We've already seen what it did uh, 
when I was parked on the tracks deliberately, uh, I would not want to come across that accidentally in a tunnel. That would not end well for the poor Deyu. Oh, that's not quite as smooth or a slope down here as I had hoped. We're fine. We're, <laughs> we're managing to damage the car in silly and idiotic ways, but... It's still going. It's still trucking along quite nicely. Oh, bugger, 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 bugger. Dare you? I hope you can... Oh, no, we don't got to really worry about flying. I hope you can swim slightly. We're fine across that one, taking an alternate route. We're fine across this next one. I think even the Dayu can get up the speed to cross this water. Come on, don't drown now. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> the next bit, though, that is going to be the problem. This bridge, if we can make it to the bridge, I mean, we'll worry about the, the crossing the bridge when we get to it. Um, if we can make it across the bridge, ooh, that was a bit of a launch. We are fine. We are fine. Ooh, have the army been nice? Ah, oh, yes, they have. They've got a, a whole horde of vehicles. A whole horde of vehicles stuck at the entrance of the bridge, which means I was clear. We got across the bridge, we've made it to the dangerous road, which is more than actually quite a lot of cars can say in this series. It's not that easy just to get here. Oh, although that's not a that's not a good first first vehicle to find. Oh, we're a little bit we're a little bit slow getting going again. Oh bugger. Oh bugger, 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 bugger. Yes, maybe. Uh oh. I've just seen the next one is on its way already. Come on, keep going. Ow. We're good. We're not bent a wheel up. How have we not been killed in all of that? Oh, we might have Oh, we might have done something I'm unfortunate with the car. I think we have bent a wheel up. I might have lied because all of a sudden we've lost a lot of... Pa Either that or it's just that this hill is now so steep that we're struggling to climb it anyway. That might also be a factor. Uh, no, we have. We've locked up a rear wheel. Something exploded. The good news is I think we've done the worst of the uphill climbing. So we might be able to make it... Well, I say all the way, that would be asking a huge amount of the Deyu. I don't think anything has made it down the dangerous road with a locked wheel, with the possible exception of the uh, racing buggy. I can't remember what it was called now, the Baja buggy. That might have made it, but that was still doing like 120 with a locked up wheel. So, yeah, I don't think we are going to. That wheel is causing too much issue. That's a shame. We kind of, we kind of got fired up in the air, and when we came crashing back down, uh, that's what did the damage. The good news is, in a very weird, peculiar turn of events, because all of the cars aren't despawning behind me, we are now actually getting an army escort down the dangerous road. Although, oh, they have started spawning them again in front of me. No! 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 Don't let it be the end for the day. Sorry, I've got to kill, got to kill them, because otherwise I will get shot at. And, oh, well, I've got to at least distract them. The army have rolled while chasing a 15 mile an hour day that that well done guys we're still going <laughs> we are still going uh if we maybe get you to have an accident stop look i i, I would leave you where you were if you would uh, stop shooting at me never mind you've had a crash oh that's not a fun sight that's not a fun sight at all that's the fastest my car has been going in quite a while we did actually beat the barracks in that amazingly in that confrontation the barracks is long gone and the day is still pointing in the right direction Come on! Climb! How is that climbing? I thought we'd be done for when we got to a hill like this. Because we got so little speed. Oh no, the engine coughed. The engine is coughing. It is spluttering. It is not going to make it much further, I don't think. However, all we need is a little bit more car. Just a little bit more. Just just that little bit more. A few more corners. A few more corners. Ooh. We've made it better than they did. They threw a door at me. Not the most effective tactic the army have ever used, I'll be honest. How are we still going? How on earth is an 11 mile an hour Deyu still going? Oh, it coughed again. The army stopped. The hike has fallen over. Cars are tumbling. We're about to get murdered, I think. This might be the end for us. Oh, come on. Squeeze around it. Yes. We're round. We're round the barracks. Oh, this is the last hill. In fact, this is the last hill for the day you should climb. Can we do it? I mean, this corner here has no end of problems for the army. They tend to just throw cars off. We're leaking fuel now as well. So, everything is broken. Everything is utterly, utterly broken in the Nez. We are going to the top of the hill. No! Oh, there's fire! Oh, there's fire! But we've almost made it! We will go out in a blaze of glory if we can just make it around this next corner. We're going to have to throw it off the mountain and cheat because we're not going to make it down the actual proper course. There we go. Gravity! 
Get me out of- No! Well, I mean, we kind of made it. <laughs> oh, We needed about 20 more seconds. We needed about 20 more seconds for it to be a, a proper complete of the dangerous road. However, that being said, that is quite possibly the most spectacular we have we have really done down the dangerous road. That's got so much further than a lot of um, a lot of other normal vehicles, which is incredible to think that uh, that a day you would be able to do that in such bad condition as well. As per usual, as per usual, when it comes to the uh, the versus the armies, the day is any any day you really is the sort of vehicle that uh, that you want to go for. They are just the single greatest getaway cars of all time. The army just do not know what to do with them. Even in the most ridiculous of uh, conditions, the army are really quite unable to uh, <laughs> to keep up. However. With a nice Prius barbecue, that is uh, going to be it for this video, guys. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. As ever, I will put links to all the mods I've used in the description. I really highly recommend you go and check out this Dayu because it's an absolutely phenomenally detailed, detailed mod. It's great fun to mess around with and apparently the best getaway vehicle of all time. However, until next time, uh, goodbye. <laughs>